KK will not survive being locked up for a lot of reasons which we will discuss today. So make sure you watch this video until the end. You will not want to miss what we have to show you. Also, if you are new to the channel, please subscribe, leave a like on this video, and comment TayK on this video to be entered in this month's Dre Beats giveaway. Now, for those who don't know, TayK has been found guilty and charged with 55 years. And other cases that are still pending, he still faces life in prison. And with his living conditions on the inside, it doesn't seem like he's going to last for very long. And he will just not survive being locked up for this long. So obviously things are not looking good for this young rapper who did make a huge name for himself. He has been found guilty and he does still face up to 99 years in prison, life in prison, never will see freedom again. And if he's if he's ever free at all, it's a very slim chance because he has a lot of other crimes to answer for. So I don't think he'll see another day of freedom and it just gets worse because what he's facing inside that jail cell and what he's been through, it doesn't seem like he's going to last very long. So if you are a Tay K fan, this is not good news for you. So those who don't know about what's going on, Tay K is currently sitting in prison on trial facing two separate murder charges. And if that's not bad enough, he's also facing charges of aggravated robbery and having a prohibited item in a correctional facility. That was from him having a phone and he posted a photo of of himself while he was in jail that's obviously not a big charge compared to what else he's facing but that just adds on to the pile he's also being accused of having involvement in a home robbery that left one man dead and he's also accused of being involved in a fatal shooting of another man in san antonio this happened in a chick-fil-a parking lot and the reason for him a young successful rapper committing these crimes who knows? It's honestly very dumb when you've made this much success for yourself. Why would you just ruin it? It doesn't make any sense. And the house he robbed, it had previous past investigations connected to drugs. That's why police believe the first incident was drug related. Not too smart to get involved in something like that when you're already making a lot of money off of your music because you actually have some success in the music industry and since being locked up he just hasn't been able to stay out of trouble he's been in and out of trouble for using a phone along with starting a fight with another inmate when they found the phone that conflict had him moved into a maximum security jail which is where he is now He's not good at staying out of trouble and usually when you're in predicaments that involve the law, it's pretty obvious that you should stay low key and out of sight as much as possible, but apparently that's not how Tay K goes about his business. In his music video for his song The Race, Tay K is actually seen bragging and posing in front of a wanted poster of himself and it just kind of seems like he's purposely trying to get himself locked up because that's got to be the dumbest thing you could do when you're already in trouble why are you basically just holding up a sign that says arrest me it's not smart when you're facing these actual charges and he just doesn't seem to be someone who wants to make the right decisions and it's finally caught up with him which is why with the newest updates on his trial he is finally answering for all of his mistakes like i said he has been found guilty and charged with 55 years and that is not all he faces he still has a lot to atone for he did not he was not found guilty of actual murder because he was not the one who pulled the trigger. That would have carried a mandatory 40-year sentence just to add on to everything. But there were also six others that were also charged in the robbery murder case. So someone else was actually accused of the actual murder charge, but he was still accused and found guilty in that case. And that's just one of his problems, like I said. He's now going to be attending a new trial to await his verdict on a separate murder case, as well as being charged with beating and robbing a 65-year-old man. He did say in a video that he did not do this. He did not beat up and rob a 65-year-old man. You don't know if that's true or not. I mean, already facing 55 years plus maybe life in prison, there's not really much incentive for him to lie. Maybe he still has hope that he's going to get out in 55 years and live his life, but who knows? He was in a video saying that he did not actually do that crime. And with all of these crimes piled up together, it just cannot look good in the eyes of a judge and jury, which make his future behind bars for life almost look certain, which is sad if you are a Tay K fan. No more music for him. He's a very young 
young successful rapper who just came up in the industry and he kind of blew his whole wave which was just a stupid thing to do you had fans you had money you had a bright future and then you just decide to do stupid things like this hang around the wrong people and just mess up your life also a thing of notice is a long time ago he was seen in a picture in jail wearing a red suicide watch jacket which kind of had a lot of people thinking that he was going to commit suicide and now that he's gonna be in jail for possibly his entire life it kind of in my opinion seems like he's gonna maybe go down that road again he's very young and when you're that young facing life in prison it doesn't seem to have a very bright future in front of you obviously you don't have much to look forward to and if he was already considering suicide in jail, he might be double considering it now. We'll have to wait and see if that's the case. But if he is found guilty in life in prison, I would not be surprised if he went down that path and actually decided to end it all this time. It's not a very far stretch. I don't want to say that that's the case, but it could possibly happen. And long-term prison time for anyone is a very hard thing to deal with, especially at such a young age. TK is only 19 and he possibly may never have another day of freedom as long as he lives. So finding a way out, a quick way out, may be the thing that he intends to do. And it's got to be very rough for him on the inside because he's going to be in a maximum security prison. That means that he's going to be around a lot of people that are going to be very hard to deal with. And being such a small young kid, it's going to be very, very, very hard to deal with. So I guess we'll just have to wait and see what happens on his next trial. If he is going to be acquitted of those charges and 55 years will be his max sentence. Or if he is going to be found guilty again and he will have a life sentence without the possibility of parole. Which means he will either have to find a life for himself in prison for the rest of his life. Or he's just going to end it and take the easy way out. You never know. Hopefully that's not the case, but we will have to see what happens. He still has some things to look forward to. I mean, he still has a lot of fans and support from the outside. He recently was um, seen in a tweet or something saying that he wants his fans to send him money. I don't think that that's a good way to secure your fans, even though it might not matter anymore because you're here, you're on the inside, they're on the outside. But having some fan support could be a very crucial thing to get you through the dark times and when you're just asking your fans for money that's obviously not a very smart move to do but this kid obviously does not make very smart decisions so we'll just have to see what happens on the next trial i am going to end the video here if you are a tay k fan leave a like on this video also i do want to know your opinion on this situation do you think he's going to be found guilty for a life sentence or do you think he's going to make it through his prison term do you think he might end it there's a lot of conflict and controversy around this whole topic, so let me know what you think in the comments. If you are new to the channel, please subscribe, and I will see you in the next one.